Boys Planet's sequel announcement is already facing backlash for so many reasons. Mnet has announced its new reality K-pop survival competition show, Boys 2 Planet. After the success of 2023 show Boys Planet, which formed Zero Base 1 out of its top 9 contestants, Boys 2 Planet will take a slightly different approach, though. While Zero Base 1 is a global group, including Korean members as well as Chinese and Canadian, the new show will debut two groups simultaneously, one Korean and one Chinese. So, there will not be one global group like Zero Base One. Netizens were shocked by the announcement of the new survival show. Yet, more than anything, the choice to debut two groups divided by nationality raised eyebrows. Boys Planet 2 happening meanwhile in watching four survival shows at once. And we will not be watching Boys Planet 2. Netizen suspect Net is trying to capitalize off the Chinese market by taking an approach like EXOK and EXOM. Two of the most popular Boys Planet contestants were Chinese, Ricky and Jong Hao. Like it's just so obvious that they could not stand the fact that a foreigner won a Korean show that they had to do everything to separate it. Half the fun of Boys Planet was seeing G and K group interact like not only is Net evil but they are dumb as as well. Jong Hao winning the whole of Boys Planet scared them so bad they had to bring back the EXOK, EXOM strategy. I'm crying Net is so obsessed with EXO, and shamelessly wants to have their own EXOK and EXOM so bad. Yet, Zero Base One fans pointed out that Net and Wake One have not even been able to properly treat their current foreign members. Ricky, especially, has been the victim of multiple instances of neglect and mistreatment. Oh this is pissing me off so bad WD with C and K now for BP2? Are they trying to particularly enter Chinese market now? When bitch SMFS can't even treat the center P01 of Boys Planet who is Chinese, right? I hate this old QM net. Boys Planet was sinophobic to the C trainees, evil editing them especially, cutting their screen time and making nasty comments about them. Couldn't swallow one debuting as the center and the other one as P04, treat them like Sechati and ZB1, but want to expand to C market now? Shameless. Fans believe net never expected the popularity of Zero Base One's Chinese members and was upset that a foreigner ranked number one became the center of a K-pop group. They suspect this is Mnet's response to ensure that history doesn't repeat itself. Jong Ha doesn't own his success to anyone he proved himself and was voted as group center BC of his talents won every live audience voting with the highest score. His rank only keep raising and never dropped once had a 100% winning rate the entire show, he made himself debut ASP01. Imagine being so iconic that a whole ass company changes their system for the next program. Net why are you so afraid of Ricky's viralism and Jong Hao Center impact? Likewise, Zero Base One fans feel it's not practical for Mnet Wake One to debut more groups when Zero Base One has already been seemingly mismanaged and poorly treated. So they're gonna debut TWO completely new groups when they can't even handle the groups they have now Elm Fao Mnet is such a joke. Additionally, fans feel that the talent and dynamic of Zero Base One and the original Boys Planet cannot be replicated. Boys Planet went viral for many reasons. Many trainees were talented and debut ready, while others were charming and progressive. Meanwhile, Boys 2 Planet will air in 2025.